Now once the ground preparation has been done, you see come down to the most important thing is the turf laying. Now, best to do with the turf, if you have a straight line in the garden, always start along that edge. It gives you a nice straight line to work with the whole way across the garden area. We would always suggest sticking to scaffold boards or planks to actually stay off the turf once it's laid. By doing this it prevents any dips or hollows being put in the newly laid lawn um, and it actually helps compress the turf to the soil so it's helping root it nice and quickly. Um, so once, the once you get your first line of turf laid then you start, start on the second line and it's always very important to make sure the turf is staggered. Uh, if the joins are next to each other, they can dry up very, very quickly and leave gaps between the lawn, which again will create a problem. I'm rolling the turf, get it out of the soil. And as you unroll the lawn, push the edges down, again, so there's no gaps between. With the medallion turf, you have nice, clean edges to the sides, so you can bring them in nice and tightly. It's not necessary to overlap this turf because of the edges, but don't leave any gaps in the side. Once you've laid the first turf, make sure it's pushed in, so there's no pockets of air underneath, and move on to the next one. Again, nice and tight with the joints, and uh, here we know we've got the first joint here, we stagger the second one by about 18 inches. So they don't overflap. As you lay the turf, we suggest flapping the boards over the whole way across the lawn and then just compacting, just treading it in again just to make it nice and flat and you get a nice clean edges. <laughs> 